What's up guys, my name is Lewis Lewis and I know this looks really weird right now but I just finished post um finished filming a video where uh, the part two of doing my make my eyeshadow was just using my LED lights um which basically meant that you just have one colour on but you can't really see what the actual colours were and you have to do your eyeshadow without having like a torch or a bright bright colour on so I did green for the first one and then red for the second video and this is what the first second one turned out to be I'm just gonna wipe this off there we go so what I said in the last video was that I was going to um Swatch all of the colours. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you. This is what my foot looks like after doing the last video. So I'm gonna swatch all these James Charles palette colours on my wrists. On my arms, I mean. Sorry. <laughs> anyway. So this is my James Charles palette and there are a lot of colours in here so let's get on with it. So we're going to start from up the top. So we're going to go for this like natural just skin coloured colour which I use to go back to school. I might go back to school. So that's how pigmented it is on my finger but on my arm pretty pigmented I'm not going to lie. Then we're going to go for this shiny one, which I normally just put in the corner of my eye, which, as you can tell, is really pigmented. Like, look how... Sh oh, you can't really see. You can't really see it because of my torch, but... No. That's... Why is it gone so dark in here? What the heck? Sorry, take... There you go. So it's pretty shiny if we turn this way. Pretty shiny, which is quite good. So then the next thing, I'm just going to go with it and you're just going to have to see. This. This colour, which looks pretty pigmented on my finger, but they all have so far. Oh, this one, you just need a lot on, which is a problem to some people but to me that is gorge it's this side over here um in real life it looks a lot more pigmented than it does on camera um so yeah pretty pigmented yeah. well if, why doesn't it look pigmented on camera then because right now that is really pigmented there we go um, pretty pigmented for a reddish orange, very pigmented, shiny red colour, like a metallic, but it looks metallic orange on ca uh, camera, see, pretty pigmented. I'm really glad that my auntie got me this for Christmas. Um, this brown shimmery colour, which is good if you want that. If you like, like wearing that type of colours on your eyes. But not that pigmented. But it is pretty pigmented. But you just can't see the shininess of it on camera. But you still see that's pigmented. Then up in this corner is a dark brown. Which, mm-hmm is very 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 pigmented it looks kind of black on camera but it is brown now I'm gonna go pigment not so good on camera we're gonna go up to my sleeve um this is a shimmery pink, 
natural colour which I kind of use as well sometimes. You can barely even see that in real life but all on camera but it is like a natural shimmery colour so what to expect and I'm going to go for a different hand now because a finger now because that's a bit weird. It's gone all dirty. I'm going to go for this colour and that is quite pretty. Oh yes, I'd love that and that would be very nice lip um lipstick colour. <laughs> um next one is this pink. Pink 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 shiny pink. Oh that's nice. Let's do it. It's not as metallic as you would think it is. Which don't bother me that much. Now what last one which is I know is very pigmented is this red which as you can tell I've used a lot of and yeah. Look how pigmented that is. Yes. So <laughs> that's the first arm. Now let's do this arm. So there is this. I'm going to do these three. Which is a dark brown, this uh, purpley brown, and this shiny purpley brown. So we're going to go one, two, three. Just so, yeah. We're going to do one, two, three. What the frig? Wait, that needs more. That doesn't make any sense, cause considering they are three different colours. But, we're going to go for it. Then we're going to go for the white. These three, so it's yellow, a shimmery colour and white. We're going to go for the white, the shimmer and the yellow. So the white looks pretty pigmented on this. But on my arm... Not very. None of these are very pigmented. Like you can barely even see that I'm that on my arm. Which uh -huh. um. Now we're gonna go for the orange color, this brown color, and this dark brown color. I know this video is pretty boring, like the rest of my videos, but we're just gonna go for it. That's the pigment. There, there, but there. Oh, they are very pigmented. Like, yes, they are quite pretty together. It looks like there's just a huge gap, but there's actually colour there. Um, wait, I'm going to use this way. Didn't I just use these? And then I'm going to try not to get them on. Well, yeah, I will wipe my fingers, but I was going to say, try not to wet my fingers because it might make it a little bit more pigmenty. Um, so just wipe them. Now we're going to go for black, yellow and green. Black, which I know is very pig Wrong hand. Black, where I know is very pigmented. Like, look at that. Yellow, which... It's kind of pigmented, but you have to have a lot of it on for it to be pigmented. And then this shimmery green, which is actually pretty lush or gorgeous. So I'm going to go for black, like I said, pigment. Yellow is actually pretty pigmented. And this shimmery green, very pigmented. That's very like army style looking makeup, which I might do one day. Because I'll get bored. So now we're going to go for the other side of my arm. So now we're going to go for this shimmery blue. So shimmery blue, like a dark bluish. And this purpley blue. Violet, I think. So we're going to go for the shimmery blue, which is very shimmery. And very pigmented. This other blue, which is very pigmented. And this purpley blue, which I don't think I've used before, so I'm wrecking it. Which is very pretty. 
which is very Elsa, which I might do a video with that as well. Okay, blues, which I think I've already done a blue video before, but yeah. That is gorgeous. Yes, they're gorgeous. Um, so the next colour is the three purples. So there's a shimmery purple, a purplish pink and a baby pink. So the baby pink um, isn't very pigmented like you can barely tell it's on my finger. Um, the purplish pink is very very pretty. I love that colour. And then the shimmery purple isn't that, well it is but it's not that shimmery. So we're going to go for the pink which I'm very disappointed in. The purpley pink which is gorgeous. And then the shimmery purple which again I am very very disappointed in. Um, wait that, let me try and pull them down a little bit so it doesn't look as bad. Why does it look like that? So I love this colour in real life. It looks a lot better. But anyway, moving to another wet wipe because you need wet wipes in your life to wipe all the makeup on. So now we're gonna go for the three greens. So it's this very, very, very pigmented green. Yes. This very, very, very dark pigmented green. And this kind of pigmented, pretty bluey green, which is kind of cute. I love that. So now we're going to do it. Sort it down. The bluey green, like I said, not that pigmented. The dark green, very pigmented. And the light green, not as pigmented as I thought. Oh, they're not that bad. I look nuts. Um, so the next thing is this. So there's this bluish purple. There's this shimmery dark blue. There's this dark purple, which I know is very pigmented. So that is a gorgeous colors mixed together. Like these two. And these two and these two are very pretty together. So we're gonna go for the purple first, which I told you very pigmented. The blue, which I told you very pigmented, and the other blue, I told you very pigmented. Which my arm looks very fun right now, but yeah, I told you very pigmented. And then the last two. Um, is this light, light purple, not shimmer, which are quite pigmented, and this hot pink, which isn't very pigmented. It looks pigmented on camera, but yeah. So the pink, actually not that bad, but not the best. And then the purple, um, very, very pigmented. So these are my arms. So now I'm gonna pull them off. But no, I'm not gonna pull them off. I'll pull them off off camera when I finish this video. But yeah, so this is the my arms right now. As you can tell, I'm very glad that a lot of these are pigmented. Um, so it wasn't a waste of money, and I'm very thankful to have this, have these, because it's helped me be confident in my makeup because it before I had a bit of issues like thinking well if the makeup isn't good it's my fault type of thing and if the if it wasn't pigmented enough I blame it on myself and it wasn't that good but when my mom got me this palette it well my auntie got me this palette for Christmas it really helped me and like um it helped me get over and say oh my god this is pigmented and I'm proud of myself for what the looks I've done like at the start of this video I know that sounds a bit stupid right now for the way it actually looked but like I've done quite a lot of good looks with this and I'm just proud of myself and yeah remember to love yourself and not everything is your fault um uh, yeah so please subscribe like 
unsubscribe to my channel. Um, I'll see you later. Bye.